Well, Lindita has the perfect complement to her arroz con pollo recipe. Who doesn't love quesadillas? Here's how to make them sizzle. So we're back and we've moved everything over to prepare our little quesadillas. And I'm doing two different kinds of quesadillas today. I'm making it actually with two different types of tortillas. And we have the flour. And did you know that there are two sides to a tortilla? This is the outside and this is the inside. Okay, and you always put your food on the inside. How do I know that? I don't know, my mother told me. So we're gonna let this kind of cook up a little bit. So we're gonna add a little cheese to it. And of course, I use about a hand and a half. I'll go figure out how that happened, I don't know. But yeah, use as much cheese as you'd like. Okay, and this one, we're gonna add a little, add your own salsa, fresh salsa to it as well. Okay, just sprinkle it on like that. Or the tortilla. Okay. And you'll see how pretty that looks and you serve that with your caldito, con tu arroz con pollo, no? So we're gonna cover that up. And then I also use a little top of my skillets to kind of speed up the process. And we're gonna do that with the corn tortilla as well. Warm it up a little bit. I see. We're gonna add a little cheese again. This time you don't need as much. And I do use the Mexican cheese to make it look nice and pretty. And of course, I'm gonna use jalapenos with this. Now, there's two different things you need to learn today is that um, when you get the veins in the jalapeno, it means that it's hot, okay? And this is what I actually use. This is the hotter. And, and if it doesn't, it's the mild. And we're gonna add a little jalapeno right to the tortilla here. And we're gonna cover that up as well. We also have, um, that we, that we use at home is called a comal. And you can buy these at any grocery store. So if you don't have a skillet like this, go ahead and get one. And my mother used to say that it always brings good luck to your home. So my sons, my family, we all have a comal on our, on our stove. So just thought I'd throw that in. So now that this is cooking up, you wanna just check and see, okay? I'm gonna give this a try as well. Flip it over, yee-haw. And they are ready to rock and roll. And you'll see how pretty that looks. We're gonna take that off. Put it on your, your board. And just go ahead and cut them up and bite. You know, kind of like pizza slices, no? Una cruz, make a little cross. And you can cut them smaller if you like. They're ready to go. Look how pretty that looks, no? This is just with the jalapeno. You can add some salsa to that if you'd like. It's not, uh, how pretty, no? Nice presentation. And next, we're gonna get going with our arroz con pollo and serve it up, no? Okay, so now we're back and we brought our little skillet, our arroz con pollo, and it is simmering. Ooh, la, la, I can, Smell the aromas, boy. Reminds me of home. And we're gonna add our final touches to our wonderful soup here, arroz con pollo. And you can use your own fresh salsa, anything that you prefer, but this is what I prefer is, of course, linditas. And I'll add a cup to that. And it also gives it color. You know, color is so important in your food. We're gonna let that simmer for a little bit more. And then, actually, I'm gonna go ahead and add some cilantro to it. And I take like a little hand, right, a little bunch, right? And you can also add it at the end too. I'm gonna add our cilantro to it. Give it another little stir here. And next, we're gonna get ready to eat. E la la. Since I knew that was gonna take a little time to prep for you, I have one already made. And now you're ready to serve it up, no? Okay, well let's get started. And I mentioned the arroz, you know how it kind of opens up, it pops open, and that's how you can tell when it's really done. And of course, your chicken. And you can add, um, I, I love the, uh, the drumstick, okay? So I'm gonna toss one in there. Ooh la la, si me gusta. Mm. Oh, my mother would be, ay ay ay. 
Just brings back those memories, honey. And if, again, you can serve it up with a little avocado on the side. And, you know, take some of that fresh cilantro, because I've added some already into it. But once it cooks, I mean, it's good, but you want some color in there as well. And of course, I'm, I'm a pepper girl también. I do like my pepper. I do like it a little spicy. So add it to your liking, okay? Don't hold back. And of course, we made our wonderful quesadillas, and I made it with the corn. Uh, you know, the Mexican cheese and some jalapenos, and I did use the hot as well. And put it on your plate like that, and look how pretty is that, no? Now, I gotta taste it and make sure it's good enough to eat. Mmm, and you're gonna enjoy it too. Arroz con pollo, con lindita. For this recipe and many more, visit linditasalsa.com. And be sure to check out more of Lindita's favorite recipes online at youtube.com forward slash the Aurora channel.